Taking a look at stock ticker symbol ERBB right now, currently traded at 0015. Uh, we're going to have a little bit of resistance there as well, but I want to pay attention to uh, some top levels, okay? Uh, the main levels that really, really matter right now instead of every single point because technically I could put a support and resistance level at every level at 1.5, uh, 1.6, 1.7. And then uh, over here, let's go ahead and throw one in there at 0.1175, okay? Because technically that's where it would be, but that's not what we're doing here. What we're going to be paying attention to is going to be getting back above that 0.017 and essentially the 0.014 is going to need to hold here. Now we went through this one. Uh, that's going to be over here on January 8th. And you guys were traded at 0018, okay? At that time, you guys ended up closing at 17 off of that. Uh, but over here, you guys didn't get that break. And I said that right there. A break of 0018 would be bullish again. You guys can go back and check that video as well from January 8th uh, to see what the chart looked like at that time. But you guys were, it did look like you guys were going to get that bounce off that 1.4 when you guys got back up there. But unfortunately, couldn't make it happen. And that 0018 pushed you back down to that 6, that 1.6. And then off of that, 1.4 down there at the bottom, again, is going to be that support level that we're going to be watching as a must hold. Otherwise, we could see 12 and then down here on the past at 11. But right now, let's, let's go ahead and keep positive on this one. And watch for that break of that 1.7 up here at that top, that uh, 20 day simple moving average. Uh, again, that 0.017. That would be the bullish move now. So that's no longer going to be that 18. That big one right now is going to be 17 now. Again, you know what? Indicators move. And that's what I always stress to everybody. Indicators always move. That's why you need to stay on top of it. You just don't do a chart and then six years from now expect that chart to be uh, still, you know, relevant. So zeros are uh, resistance again at that 0016. 0016. Followed up by the 17, 18. But important is going to be the other levels. Like I said, 2 2. Support. 0014 must hold. Watch for a break of 0017. All right, so perfect. That's gonna be that's gonna get it all wrapped up right there. Uh, resistance at one six. Okay, that resistance level is at one six right now because that's where the ten and thirty day simple moving average is. Okay, at the twenty day, which is at zero zero one seven. That's why those numbers are really close together. Then of course you're gonna have that eighteen resistance. But the big one that right now, if you guys start tapping on that eighteen, that's gonna be a good sign. And that's what I would be personally watching for. Again, that's what we just said here as well. So again, ERBB. If you guys follow the stock, I encourage you to join investorshangout.com. The link is in the description below for the ERBB stock message board. We share your thoughts and your opinions with the tens of thousands of other active investors on Investors Hangout and also have unlimited access to all the cool tools and free stock data.